1937, the Principality of Gallia. Still reeling from the recent invasion, Gallia now faces new troubles from within. Following the ceasefire between Gallia and the Imperial Alliance, a new Archduchess, Cordelia Guy Randgris, chooses to make public her Darkson heritage. Many respond favorably to her candor, but not all. United by their hatred of the Darksons, a group of nobles forms the Gallian Revolutionary Army. Commonly known as the Rebels, their campaign to purge Gallia of any Darkson influence soon earns them great favor in the South. The stage is set for the Gallian Civil War. <laughs> hmm. I'll do it. Lanseal Royal Military Academy, the oldest and most prestigious martial institution in all of Gallia. Here cadets drill tirelessly to live up to the standards set by those who have gone before, the school motto never far from their thoughts. Victory through diligence, peace through strength. I'll do it! Hey! Huh? Is this seat taken? Nope. All yours. Thanks a lot. Hey, so, uh, my name's Yvonne. Nice to oh, meet you. Uh, hi! My name's Cosette Yvonne. It's really nice to meet you. And thanks for the seat. Hey, any time. <clears throat> I'm trying to concentrate, if you don't mind. Honestly. Honestly. Just a minute. Huh. Hey. Hey.
I'm Rodriguez, that's sir to you. I'm the proctor for your field exam. You will now form teams of three and participate in simulated combat. Answer when called. Cosette Colherth. Yes, sir. Next is Zeri. Yes, sir. Last up, Avon Hardens. Yo, sir. You are Team A. Hey, we're on the same team, Avon. Let's give it our best shot. You bet. All set to go, Zeri? Just my luck I get the two of you dumped on me. Excuse me? You care to repeat that, tough guy? Uh, hey guys, stop it! We should focus on the test now. Pipe down, maggots! If you're ready to begin, step forward. You won't be using live ammo here, but a hit to the wrong spot can still kill. Don't go dropping your guard just because this is a simulation. As if. I've got plans, and none of them involve dying here. Oh, I'm all nervous. I hope this goes well. It's like my brother used to say. Uh, oh yeah. Envision the self you wish to be, then take action to become him. We're gonna win this. In a landslide, for sure. All right, let's go, you two. Move out. Okay. <laughs> Zeri, Cosette, we're beating these guys and getting in! Listen up! Watch and learn. Moving out! You're through! Yes!
I see one! Enemy down! Watch and learn. Okay, let's go! All right! Enemy spotted! I see one! down Okay, let's go! Okay, let's go! Coming at ya! Alright! They've got to let us in after that!
Yes! We did it! I have all three of you on Team A as having passed the written exam. Guess that means you're in. Yay! I was so worried about the field exam, but we did it! It's because you guys helped push me along. No worries. <laughs> the field exam was the only part I wasn't worried about. Next is the aptitude screening, you two. I try not to dawdle. What aptitude are they screening? Nah, guess we'll find out soon enough. We're ready to screen you. Step through the gate, please. What is it? That blue glow is Ragnite, right? What does this thing tell you? I don't get it. I did it, Avon! I got placed as an engineer! Is that what you wanted? Yeah! I want to be a doctor someday. Wow, that's pretty impressive. What did you get, Zeri? I placed as a shock trooper. And you? I'm not really sure. They told me I could be any unit class I wanted. Oh, does that mean you have an aptitude for all of them? That's amazing! That, or an equal lack of aptitude for any of them. You jerk! You gonna be like this all the time? Don't you two start again. We all just made it in. Let's try to get along. Yeah, I guess you're right. We're in this together now, guys. Woohoo! I came here with a purpose. And I'll tell you now, it isn't to pal around with clowns like you. I'm going to the headmaster's office now for my class placement. What's that kid's problem? Thinks he's so special because he's got glasses. Um, I kind of doubt it's because of his glasses. Ooh, but I should head off now, too. I'll see you later, Yvonne. All right, next stop, the headmaster's office. Maybe I can get some info about Leon out of him while I'm there. It's worth a try, at least. Enter. Avon Harden, sir. I just passed the entrance exam. Ah, congratulations. Let me be the first to welcome you to Lancio. I am the headmaster here, Lawrence Clivert. It's nice to meet you, Avon. Hmm. It seems your exam results place you in Class G. I hope you'll make the most of your time here at Lancio, my boy. Um... Is there something else, son? I wanted to ask you about my brother, Leon Hardens. Leon was your... I see. Leon was just a student here. How could he just go and die? Your brother was a student of great promise and a true patriot. He stood out amongst his peers in intelligence, strength and leadership. Uh... I'm afraid national security concerns prevent me from giving details. But just before his death, he was appointed to a special mission. A special mission? That's right! I remember it from Leon's letter! I've been selected for a special mission. It's an honor and an opportunity. That was his last letter. The next I heard was from that Brixen guy. As I imagine you know, this is Gallia's only military academy, Ivan. The students here study and train tirelessly to keep their nation safe. That was Leon's aim in accepting the mission that cost him his life as well. Sadly, that is all I can tell you. That and that your arrival here... Well, I feel Leon's hand is guiding you to us. Maudlin as it sounds. <sighs> Galia's people are living in fear and anguish in the face of rebel atrocities. I pray you will grow to become a powerful force for justice, Avan. Yes, sir. I'll do my best. Ha <laughs> ha! 
I'll do it! Here, just under the wire. What are you doing here? Oh, hey, it's Zeri. What do you mean, what are we doing here? We got put in Class G. What? Oh, of course I had to be placed with you. Oh, wow! Yay! I'm in Class G, too! All three of us are together! This academy has ill use for a group of failures such as yourselves. Whoa, is that coming from the classroom? Hmm, identify yourselves. Me? I'm Yvonne Hardens. I'm in Class G, starting today. Hmm, another fine misfit for your pathetic little club. I am Juliana Everhart. Chair of Class A, the finest class at Landseal. Your class is a sort of landfill for those with abysmal entrance scores. Hey, what's your deal? It's the unalloyed truth. <laughs> you haven't even produced a class chair. Your sustained presence at this academy shames me. You stain Landseal's name. I put it to you, Rejects. Is there not a single volunteer for a class chair? Uh, um... Hmm. Not a one. You see? Just as I said, Class G is a... Here! Huh? What, me? Wait a second. What are you doing? What? Oh, oh my! What am I doing? I just got so angry listening to her talk, my hand just shot up! With my hand in it? Hmph. Huh. Ridiculous. It's painfully obvious that you don't have what it takes. What? What's your problem, talking down to everybody like you own the place? You want a class chair? Fine, I'll do it! Please. You're barely fit to follow, let alone lead. That takes an elite. What a tiresome word. There are few things more pathetic than the pedigree of a self-styled elite. Y you impertinent beast! A darkson! Presuming to mock me! I'll have your... What's going on here? Even you lot don't usually make this much noise. Brixum! Juliana, is there a reason you've chosen to visit us today? Professor Brixham, I was just on my way. 
All right, let's begin today's lesson, shall we? <laughs> Yo! Ha <laughs> ha! Hmm. Hmm. Listen up now. I'll do it! To begin, here is today's news.